So, today's challenge. I'm gonna try and shoot a commercial in just a few hours with a limited amount of gear and props. Actually, pretty much nothing. A white background and the product. That's basically it. And then also, I want to incorporate some super basic stop motion. So, it should be an interesting one today. I want movement and I want it to sparkle, you know what I mean? So, we'll see. That's a lot of pressure, all of a sudden. Uh, okay, this is my setup. A white background, just two sheets of white paper that I found. And then one main light, my Godox SL60W. On the other side, a reflector illuminated by my Pixel RGB light. And then of course, on the tripod will be my Sony A7S III with an 85mm for most of the shots. Okay, let's start shooting. I set up the opening shot here because in the opening shot I want the box to come fly into the frame, literally. So I attach the box to some string with some clear tape and then up there it's mounted to my microphone boom arm. And now I'm just gonna swing it and hope that it looks cool. And just let it swing a few times okay and obviously guys I'm gonna remove the strings in post also for the next shot the jumping box shot what yeah so the idea is that the box of Tic Tacs jumps on the beat I'm gonna hold the strings with my hand I have the song in my head and then <sighs> let's try it I set the focus manually again right here and I mark this point so that I know that I have to put the box here every time I try again right there and now song is in my head jump on the beat I guess <laughs> oh yeah. yeah that's also not good it has to land facing the camera of course oh that wasn't too bad okay no no this will work Again, I'm just gonna do it a bunch of times and then hopefully I have a good one. Getting the hang of it. Okay, so I need two more shots of the boxes. One shot is where I hit them together like that on the beat of the music. And then another shot where I do like that on the beat of the music. And then two should come out, two Tic Tacs. Hopefully two. Hello. So. <laughs> I'm gonna um, lie under the table because I have to hold the boxes at the bottom and then the shot I'm gonna cut off uh, so that you only see the top half of the boxes. Let's try it. Oh, this is hard. Oh my god! <laughs> I think I have one. Okay, and the next shot is an open box and then on the beat I'm gonna try to make a couple fly out. Nope. Nope. Hi. This is hard. So basically, again, a million times until I get a good shot. Okay, enough. Stop motion, guys. The idea is really simple because we have all these colors. I'm gonna make patterns with the colors and then take a picture and then take away some colors and take another picture. And that a bunch of times. And then when I edit all those photos to the beat, then it should look pretty cool. I hope. I think so. So this part is pretty easy but time consuming and a little bit tedious. Okay, there. Now I'm gonna take a picture of this with the 35mm and then I'm gonna take away the pink ones for example and take another picture. Okay. I think I'm gonna add a little bit more light and now I'm gonna take away the pink ones and take another picture. Okay, rinse and repeat a bunch of times. I'm not gonna show all of that because you're probably already bored. Okay, the fun part, Tic Tacs flying around. I need three shots 
Tic Tacs falling on the white paper, then a shot of the Tic Tacs flying in midair, and then the hero shot, the final shot of the commercial, a box of Tic Tacs with Tic Tacs falling from the sky in the background. Of course, 120 frames per second again. I set the focus manually around here. Um, let's just throw the Tic Tacs and see what happens. One. No, I have to go higher, because otherwise you'll see the box, of course. Wow. Okay. One, two. Okay, mistake. I should have closed off the edges of the table. <laughs> okay, but I checked the shot and it already looks pretty good. I'm gonna do one more. I closed up the back here, so I hope that we'll keep most of them on the table. Let's try again. One, two, three. Okay. Now, Tic Tac's flying in midair, but because my background is not high enough, I'm gonna sit in front of the table and throw the Tic Tacs from under the table up, because otherwise, yeah, they will go too high and then you'll see the background. One, two, three. Oh! <laughs> it's like a unicorn is puking on me. <laughs> I don't think that was high enough. Okay, one more time. I'm just gonna sit next to the camera now. I don't think I have to lie down because it's more difficult. One, two, three. I think that was a good one. Time for the hero shot. A box of Tic Tacs and then I'm just gonna pour the Tic Tacs in the background so that it's like a unicorn puke rain of Tic Tacs falling from the sky. Something like that. Go. I think that was really good. Yeah, but let's just do it one more time, as usual. I hope you liked it guys and I hope that I inspired you by showing you that you can create something really cool with a limited amount of gear and props. White background, product, that's it. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one. Yeah, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs>